Oh no! We're being chased by werewolves. Why do we always get into all sorts of trouble? We must leave the children at this house, and we will see the wolves behind us. Hey, wolves run after me. Look how delicious I am. Good job chasing after me. What are you not as strong as I thought? Look how delicious I am. Try to catch up with us. So what do we do? There are two little kids here. We just can't leave them here. We just need workers, and these kids will work for us. Huh? What is this place? Where are we, and what is going on? Huh? Then we are in a cage, but why are we here? Hmm. What's the last thing you remember about Mikey and where your parents are? Why there are so many questions and no answers? Hmm. We were supposed to go out with our parents, and then we got attacked by werewolves. Huh? That's the last thing I remember. Hmm. Look, JJ, from what I understand about our parents being chased by werewolves, hmm. I still have a question. Why are we locked in this cage, and how do we get out of here? And why are we even here? What happened after our parents left us to save us? Uh-oh. The question is getting bigger and smaller every minute. The door is closed on the other side. I can't even reach the push plate. If I were an adult, I could reach. Listen, hmm. Mikey, maybe there's an open window or something? Look at this room, although it's more of a dungeon, but it doesn't matter. Hmm. I think this room is a very old place. I think we can find another way out of here. Maybe we can bend the steel cages or something? Look, I think I hear someone. <laughs> what? Calm down, stop shouting. What? We won't attack you or anything like that. We locked you in here because we didn't know who you were. Follow us, we'll feed you. But we don't know what kids eat, but I think you'll like it. We found you at our house and decided that you will live with us. Hmm. For what we have saved you, you will have to work for us. So we're going to work for you for free and we're going to work for you forever? Hmm. It's just something, but come on, you guys saved us so we'll repay you. Listen to the scary Enderman and you have no other food? <laughs> This food is not suitable for people. Especially, it is not allowed to children. Yep. Maybe you have fried meat or maybe pizza. No, for you we have no other food. <laughs> if you do not want, you cannot eat at all, but then you will not be able to work normally on an empty stomach. Hmm. Honestly, tastes just disgusting. <laughs> Why did you give us missing food? How are we supposed to eat what we can't eat? Yep. Better not eat anything, Mikey, and you will hurt your stomach. Oh! It is better to be hungry than to eat such poison. Hmm. All right, old Enderman. What are we gonna do next? First, I'm not so old that you call me old Enderman. <laughs> my first task will be simple. Go outside and guard my house. If anyone comes here, shoot them with onions. Hmm. Although it is better to go hunting, we have practically finished food. Woohoo! Great. Then we can get some real food, and we can get some good food. Yep. <laughs> Come on, Mikey, but let's be very careful. I hear there are wolves and other monsters in the woods. Hmm. Here, take some food with you. You said that you do not like this food. But the other we give you, we do not want. If you go hunting and bring delicious food, we will share with you. All, stop chatting and go faster to the street. <laughs> this food made me sick, yet I should not have eaten it. I knew that the puffer fish was poisoned. Yep. Look, Mikey, we need to figure out what we're gonna do next. <laughs> Hopefully we can find the werewolves who attacked our parents. Maybe we can even find some evidence. Yep. Listen, scary Enderman, where are we going? I thought we'd go alone with JJ. Or do you want to show us the place where we're going to hunt? Look, if you want to have a decent meal, maybe we can go hunting at the supermarket. There's a turn and Mikey, we have to beat them. Hiya! Maybe they're the ones who attacked us. Let's get revenge. Yeah. Just be careful of Mikey. Hiya! Remember, we don't have armor. Wolf bites are very painful, so try to dodge their attacks. Yeah. How many werewolves are there? You fight Mikey at all, or you stand and just look at me. And you, Enderman, feel not help me. <laughs> okay, we can do this without you. Listen, Mikey, attack the werewolf from behind. Try to attack one wolf at a time. Yep. Yeah. These werewolves have magical skills. Werewolves stun you. Ugh. 
So many werewolves here. It was still a bad idea to go fight with these werewolves. There are too many of them. <laughs> and we're still small, especially since we don't even have armor. <laughs> well, I was able to defeat another werewolf. There are still a few. All right, Mikey, I'm taking a temporary retreat, and I'm gonna try to get a werewolf upstairs. And I'll try to fight him one-on-one. -on -one. When you're fighting a pack of werewolves, you just can't do anything. Let the werewolf follow me. All right. Hmm. Now we're gonna get in the way, and I can finally beat these werewolves. <laughs> By the way, Mikey, I've noticed they're not werewolves. They're just monsters of wolves. And if they were werewolves, they'd stop. <laughs> All right, the wolves are getting smaller by the minute. I'm asking you to be careful. Ah! Look, Mikey, I have an idea. <laughs> I think I know what we're doing now. We can't kill these wolves alone. Let's team up and fight one wolf together. <laughs> then we'll have a chance. <laughs> <laughs> well, I knew it worked, so now we have to go to the other wolves. I'm sure I have a bow and arrow. I can shoot wolves from a Dalek, and I don't go near them without taking damage. Uh-oh. Look, Mikey, if we beat these wolves, we're gonna get revenge. They're the ones who ran after our parents. These wolves are the ones who put us in such a bad situation. Yep. Look, JJ, I've got a tactic for the fight. You hit and run, and then when the wolf can't find you on top of him, you're doing great. We almost beat all the wolves. Yeah. All these colleagues are so strong, it's an unusual wolf. They're half monsters, so they have so strong skin. Yep. We can't even hurt them practically. You have to try to beat them multiple times in one place to punch their fur. Yeah. <laughs> How tired I was, I thought we would quickly deal with these monsters. And in the end, we fought with wolves for so long that I had almost no strength left. What is that sound Mikey is watching? Oh no! Look, Enderman has attacked the villager. We have to stop the Enderman. Yep! Hiya! I've taken the Enderman to myself, and you have to get the villager out of here. Hiya! Yeah. All right! We've practically chased the Enderman away. I'll shoot the Enderman with the bow. I told you, Mikey, to take the villager away to a safer place. Hmm. Come on, JJ. Just a little bit more, and we can beat the Enderman. <laughs> Why is he so strong? It's not fair that he has the ability to teleport. It's a pity we don't have a bucket of water. <gasps> so we can easily defeat this Enderman. Hmm. It's really hard for me to hit him with a bow. He's always dodging my arrows. Yep. I agree with you. I wish we had a bucket of water. If we had a bucket of water, we'd beat him in a couple of seconds. How fast is he? Hiya! And the main thing is, Mikey, don't look your eyes into the Enderman or he'll hypnotize you. <laughs> <laughs> we did it! We could beat the Enderman. Now let's ask the villager what he's doing here. Hey, villagers, are you okay? I'm fine. Take my resources as a reward. <laughs> <laughs> but what are two kids doing in a dark forest? I can't believe you could save me. <laughs> now we've got wood and 16 whole diamonds. Mikey, you know what we can do with two whole diamond bibs. Oh. <laughs> what did you do? Why did you attack the Enderman? <laughs> he was one of us. You betrayed us, and now you will answer for it. <laughs> go home now. We'll lock you up at home, and you'll never go outside again. <laughs> now, you will work without dinner. When we get home, I will prepare more punishment for you. What? <laughs> no, you're having dinner. But you're getting sick from the puffer fish, so I'm gonna make you eat the puffer fish. Now you will forever learn the lesson that you cannot attack Endermen. Huh? We will not eat it. Give us normal food. Yep. And you are to blame. You left us in the forest. We were almost eaten by wolves. You just ran away. Now you complain. We should complain about how dumb you are. Yep. Let's see how you talk when you spend a week in a cage without food. <laughs> we'll lock you in here and feed you only fugue fish. What? And let's see what happens to you. No one's ever gotten out of this prison. <laughs> Let us go now. When we get out of here, we will blow up this house. Uh oh I promise you, Enderman. Yep. Listen, Mikey, we have to come up with an escape plan. He said no one's ever come out of this prison cell, so this team is very old. Maybe we can break some block and get out. 
Hmm. What do you think of my idea? We can hardly get out. We can't break the pressure plane. Look, maybe I have some useful resources or something? <laughs> you gave Mikey a good idea. The villager gave me wood and diamonds for saving him. So we can make a craft table and make ourselves some diamond gear and get out of this prison cell. Now we can break the iron bars and we can leave. But I suggest we take revenge on Enderman first. Yep, but first we have to make the right tools. Make a diamond pickaxe, then we can get out. <laughs> hmm. Listen, JJ, I listened to the Enderman talking about the TNT in their house. What? Let's get him and serve TNT, then we'll destroy this house. You told the Enderman you wanted to blow up the house, so that's a good choice. <laughs> Hmm. Great! Now we can get out! And with the TNT, it's unbelievable news. Now we can get our revenge on Enderman. Yep! Only we have to act very quietly. One big step, and the Enderman will wake up and attack us. <laughs> All right, JJ, break down that door. Now we have to go downstairs somewhere with TNT. It is a pity that we only have 16 diamonds. If we had more diamonds, we would make ourselves diamond armor. Hmm. But I think only our dexterity would be useful there. Listen, Mikey, do you know where the TNT is? Hmm, look, I told you I don't know where the TNT is. You can see the trunk there. This is the only chest here. I think that's where the TNT is. <laughs> all right, now let's put TNT all over the house and blow it up. All you have to do is act very quietly, and one excess TNT will explode and destroy not only this house, but also us. Great, there's 32 TNT. That's enough to use to destroy the house and I'll take a torch of red powder so we can light the TNT. Listen, Mikey, we need to split up TNT all over the house so there's nothing left. I gave that Enderman again that I would blow up his house. It wouldn't be good if I didn't keep my word. Just Mikey, don't blow yourself up when he puts the TNT in. Only I'm asking you, Mikey, don't put all the TNT in one place. Hmm. I hear you, JJ. I said the same thing to you. All right, let's go downstairs, get some trolls, and let's go. I'm a little worried the explosion's gonna be too big, and it's setting us up too, even if we leave. Let's hurry up, JJ. Soon the Engemonies will wake up, and if they see what we're doing, they'll attack us, and we'll be back in jail. <laughs> Don't worry, Mikey. We're almost done relaxing TNT. Now the question is, how do we set it on fire? I suggest you put the red torch on and run out of here. Just don't turn around, Mikey. I think the explosion will be very powerful. <laughs> Woohoo! All right, now all we need is a red torch. I wonder how big the explosion is. I think you'll see it far away. Run faster than Mikey. We'll have to get back to the village. Maybe our parents are there. <laughs> Woohoo! It was just incredible. The explosion was very powerful. It felt like it was just a big fireworks. It was very short. Now let's go home. I hope you're right and our parents are waiting for us in the village. Wait, you see this? So someone is standing. Floor your dad and my mom. I'm so glad we could find you. <laughs> <laughs> Woohoo! I'm so glad to see you, dad. I was so worried that you were a werewolf John Doe. Yep. I'm so glad you're okay. You just won't believe what happened today. We were taken in by the evil Enderman. Hmm. They meant us to spoil the food from the work. But that's not the main thing. We found those wolves that were chasing you and getting back at them. Yep. You are great children. We worried about you very much. But you did manage. We had to leave you and take away the wolves. But you managed to cope. I am very proud of you both. When we come to the village, I will buy you any toys you ask and ice cream. <laughs> 